What is up guys? Wolfhound22 here. Back with another Let's Play of Prison Architect. We finished off the first two chapters of Prison Stories, and today we're going to go ahead and start the third one. There's a riot in progress at El Camico State Prison. To make matters worth, where CEO Charles Wallace is being held hostage by one Douglas Bennett, a cop killer serving a life sentence. In this chapter, you will learn about riot control, solitary confinement, medical care, and punishments. Okay, let's begin. So, first story. Okay, here we go. This just in. A riot has broken out at Al Camico State Prison. Staff and security have fled to the perimeter and are awaiting military assistance. A number of personal personnel are still unaccounted for, including the prison's own CEO, Charles Wallace. It is believed the riot erupted following the arrest of several high-profile judges alleged to have taken kickbacks in return for imposing harsher prison sentences. CNDC can reveal that Douglas Benedict, currently serving a life term, is the ringleader behind the outbreak of violence. It is understood that Benedict himself is likely to have been a victim of the corruption occurring within the judicial system. City Mayor Calvin Heller released his statement just a few moments ago. Those who question our politics of punitive reform, this should act as a stark reminder. These men have housing and food provided, the privilege, privilege of paid work. This is how they reward the taxpayers to subsidize their comforts. Adding fuel to the fire, sources say the criminal underworld has recently been rocked by a series of high-profile deaths including mob, mob boss Victor Palermo, oh, last story there, who died under suspicious circumstances last month after a fire broke out at Regina Cole Correctional Facility. CE, CEO Charles Wallace, deputy, a relative newcomer to the post, has been tasked with restoring order. It is yet to be seen whether a lack of experience will prove costly during this difficult crisis. Is that me? Oh boy. Negotiators con okay. <laughs> okay, all right, here we go. It's out of control here. Nobody is in charge. Unconscious, unconscious. Fire's office, fire's office, fire's office. Okay. We've got multiple casualties and the remaining guards won't go into the riding cell blocks. We've had to pull back to the perimeter. What's worse is that the fog of war means we won't be able to see what's going on inside the cell blocks until we get in there ourselves. Figure out what to do and put a stop to this before it gets out of hand. A call has been made to the emergency response service. A truck full of riot gear should be here any moment. Speak of the devil and it, he shall appear. Clad and stab, be clad and stab vests are wield and wielding batons. It looks like we've been given three full squads of riot guards. These guys have been specially trained to deal with even the most intense riot situations. I need you to order these guards to sweep through all areas of the prison under inmate control. The inmate controlled areas are shown clearly in red. You can select a large group of guards easily by holding X and dragging a box around those you want to, you want to select. With the riot guard selected, move the cursor into one of the red inmate control areas and press X. Again, to issue the command to move. We need to gain control of the situation ASAP. Start by taking back the gen pop cell block three clicks south of our position. Good luck. Do I want to fire him? No, I want to fire. Okay, so we need to, I guess... Move some guys here. Restore order to the prison. Okay, so not a lot to go on. Okay, so we'll go ahead. No. No, 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 no. So we'll take these six. And. Okay, so fog of war. So I can't see anything that's going on inside. Alright. 84 prisoners of serious complaints. 84 prisoners. Everybody's rioting. Not one person. 
It's just kind of hanging back. All right, let's get in there. Well, that's the case. Let me just go ahead and take everybody then. Make it easy. All right. Go, 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 go. Move pretty swiftly. I guess I'm just generally going to clear out the prison, see where everybody's riding. So I'm going to guess the red areas are where there's riots going on. Oh, there he is! Get him! Beat unconscious. The riot cards are making a difference already. Good job. You notice that as the riot cards enter a red area, it begins to subdue rioting inmates. The red area fades away. When this happens, it means order has been restored, and our regular guards can in and then enter these areas to start to dish out any new punishments. Alright, you guys, what are you doing? Just hanging out. Dreadful, injured, fair barn. All the way. Alright. So I guess we can just go ahead and just run through the prison here. I wonder if I can just take like half up. Maybe wires to kind of split them up, maybe. So I think you have, you guys up here. You guys are gonna go over there. And you guys are gonna start working your way down here. I'm not sure if this is a good plan or not. Take him out. Do anything like that? Or is he, oh, he's going back to his cell. Alright. Looks like they're slowly going back to their cell. Get over there. Go help out your buddies. And you're all hanging back. I think all the injured guys are just kind of hopping away. Dead between their legs. Get in there, go. Take him down. It's like half the prisoners now are getting under control. Mayor Calvin Heller. I assume this is the CEO deputy with whom I'm speaking. Okay, so I'm not your architect. I'm the CEO deputy. I was mistaken in, early, in earlier stories. I appreciate this. This is a very difficult time, and we are all under intense secure, scrutiny. Rest assured, you have my full support in using any and all resources at your disposal. We gained a foothold, and we're taking some of the prison. I see there's been some loss of life so far, but given the circumstances. This is completely justifiable. Before you push on or retake the rest of the prison, you need to secure the cell blocks that you have already captured. Hire some extra guards and assign them to recapture sectors using the guard deployment screen. By doing this, we can ensure the captured cell block will stay captured. What are you guys running away from? Up here. Let's get you guys all up 
in this area. Let's go where I haven't seen anybody yet. So I guess a couple of stragglers up in there. I don't know. I was just kind of hanging out. I think I that guy. He's already injured. Alright. Let's go ahead and... Go ahead and pause first. Fire staff. Guards. Nope. Wrong. Okay. We're going to put some guards up here. No. That's all blocked. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now we're gonna get a little overboard with our deployment. So ten. Two, three, four, five. We do five there. That's not good. <laughs> they just killed my guards. Alright. I can use some force here. Why are you guards running outside? happening. No, stop. Stop. What? Okay, so when I hire them for some reason they run outside, which seems like the worst thing you can do. Don't understand. Okay, let's try this again. Guard deployment. So, I do 10, 8, 9, 10 here. So that means we got 11. So that means that we should, I guess because I need to deploy 10 there, the other 10 one is randomly trying to run outside. That's some dumb. Alright, let's go up this way. There's a whole lot of baddies up here. Oh, no. oh my guys already decided to go. They're going upon themselves. Go up this way, see if we've got anything going on. I guess maybe what I can do is just slowly work my way through. So now I got this under control, so I should be able to hire a couple some staff. Six, seven, eight, nine. Are you going outside? Don't do that. That's bad. Bad news. Oh. You see how you got? Oh my God! Look how many people were killed. Oh, he held his own. Why did you do that? Why? Where are you going? not seem like a good way to do that. Okay. 
one's a little more difficult. Yeah, that I'm being a complete noob. Which is definitely a good possibility. Alright. Alright, right, guys. Kitchen good? Alright. Get your butts back in here. Are they just going on like normal duties now? Going to eat and everything, even though there's people still riding. All right, let's get, let's go take out these guys. I guess I need to um. Hire right, 30 guards, recapture gen cell block. Yeah, okay. Let me go ahead and hire 30 guards then, real quick. We have 30 on hire. Okay, that's it. Are you the one in charge here? I'm Dr. Hannah McCoy. I'm here to help you tend to the wounded. You've got injured guards and inmates all over the prison, with more to come to no doubt. Some of them are crit in critical state. We need to set up an infirmary somewhere on site. You could construct a new building, or maybe you could just repurpose the existing room. I'll leave that to you. Once set up, we just need to hire some doctors, and they'll begin treating the injured. There are also seems to be quite a few bodies. For the sake of their dignity, we need to set up a morgue. Once the morgue has been created, doctors and guards will start bringing in the deceased. You'll need to hire workmen, I suppose, for any construction work, but be sure to keep them safe. Good luck. Oh boy. Okay, this is definitely a crazy, complicated... Not crazy complicated, but definitely a little more complicated than I was expecting. So, that is that. So, let's go ahead and get started here. We're going to construct... And build plan. What is that? This will be my infirmary. I'm mean, guessing these be pretty big for as many injuries as there are. Need to also hire some staff. Let's go ahead and get a couple number fifteen workers in here so they can get in there and really start buckling down. Um a morgue, I can't really go anywhere in particular. I can't go down there. If I can continue to move these guys around. No. Okay, we'll come back here. And make sure that area is safe. And the morgue will go. I mean, hmm. I don't know where I can have the morgue. I don't have a lot of room. Let's put it in this corner. I mean, it kind of... Well, that's how you get in. I guess I can put it, maybe put it down there. It's sort of out of the way. Okay. So, we're going to go ahead and go to structure. No. Go back here. Shoot. I don't want you guys going that way. Where are you guys going? Oh. Oh. Oh, be careful, workers. No, no, stop, stop. Don't do that. It's bad, bad news. Why, why, why would you go that way? I want you right here. Can't you just come through the main door? 
Why would they go down there? Jeez. I can't go in there yet to help clear it out. Okay, um... I don't know if they took it down. They went down that way. That's, I don't understand why they keep trying to come down here where all the riding is. Like, I understand, like, this game, they should make the AI slightly smarter. Because, like, I can't control everything on where they're going. Okay, so let's go ahead and get this more made up here. Put that right there. Put the staff door right there. The infirmary, we will like that in front. Oh, I guess I can't do anything with that yet. Can I? Probably not. This is not built. Alright. So let's, um, just do another door. That door is here. This looks like they're going to take a long way. I know this. Do I have all the staff? I mean, do I have nobody? There we go. Go that way. See? That's so much better. Oh, crap. It looks like I accidentally put a door right here. I don't want that. Dismantle. Alright, so we need some lights. Right here. Yeah, so we need lights. Construct. We'll put some power in there. Look at the power. Cable. And here, oh nice, it's already in there, perfect. I guess it's already purposed in there that was already there. And then I need... Objects. Some more slabs. And how many is good? Four. I got a little reward, I guess. And there's a ride on hand. Probably need a little bit extra than norm, a little more than normal. Right there. Medical beds. Well, I need to wait that for that to be. <clears throat> Rooms, morgue. Okay, here we go. So you are gonna be the morgue. And then I need some lighting. Rooms, walls, flooring, room, objects. Anyway, power supply. So, how do I get light? Is this made light that's already in there? Oh crap, oh okay, so I can't... So maybe now they have to wait for me to... clear that area, and now they should be able to go in there, is my guess. Okay. So we're going to construct rooms, infirmary, be right there, perfect, and then we need some beds in there, 
Smith beds. So I'm gonna say we need a lot. I figure there's a ton of people that are hurt, so let's go crazy. What? What am I missing? Oh, okay. So, then, so how do I get light in there? Oh, I need to actually move. That's right, I need to actually run cables to the light itself. Oh, that's gonna need, uh huh, I need to still run. Are you gonna come put those lights in there or what? Perhaps it'd be better if I don't run from there, if I run from the room above. How about I do this? This might make more sense. Perhaps they'll actually come and install that. Let's hire some staff, let's hire some doctors. Why is that blocked? Okay. Listen up, we've got your CEO. Oh boy. Ugh. So this is how it works. I ask, you give. Any problem, send anyone in, or if I even smell a cop, I put a bullet in his skull. We want an unmarked vehicle, blacked out windows, full tank, one hour. I'll be in touch. Boom. Oh boy. This is completely unacceptable. We need eyes on that canteen so we can see what's happening. There's a small security room to the north of the canteen. We need to secure it. Deploy some guards in there to man the CCTV console and we'll go get vision on of the whole cell block. Alright guys, um, this is definitely <laughs> slightly more difficult than the last couple, um, partly due to my, a little bit of my incompetence there, trying to figure out what was needed. Um, they apparently massacring a bunch of prison guards because they were doing weird things. But I think I got it under control now. We'll see what happens next time. But if you liked the video, please hit that like button, share, subscribe. Uh, my channel's new, so I'm really trying to build it up uh, any way possible. So uh, just look out for the next video coming sometime soon. So for now, this is Wolfhounds22 signing off.